Hello everyone, Chris Pizer from Chameleon Plasma Grow Lighting. I'd like to tell you a little bit about why plasma grow lighting is the next grow lighting to take over the industry. It's all about spectrum for us. Now, high pressure sodium being the current standard of the industry certainly is a viable product. However, uh, we trade the horsepower of high pressure sodium for the spectrum of plasma. Let me, let me equate spectrum to human nutrition. If PAR, which is the perfect spectrum of light for plants, photosynthetically active radiation, if that was human nutrition, this rainbow colored graph, and you were only receiving what high pressure sodium brings to the table, that would be about 24% of the nutrition you need as a human being. However, when we bring plasma to the table with the exceptional spectrum that it has native in the instrument, we bring 95% perfect nutrition to the table. So as an athlete, what choice would you make? As a human being, what choice would you make? Let me take you through some other numbers. So we would like to compare our 500 watt plasma against a 600 watt high pressure sodium, which actually draws 656 watts because there's some loss in the ballast. No loss for us, it's all one contained unit, which we'll show you here in just a minute. But let's go through some numbers. Our 500 watt plasma draws 22% less electricity and 22% less electrical heat loading with a 34% longer lifespan. And this is really important, no annual lamp changes. So when you calculate your return on investment, you need to consider that as well. So I was talking about perfect light nutrition and let me tell you the math on that. The benchmark is sunlight. Sunlight's color rendering index is 100. The coloring rendering, color rendering index of plasma is 95 and high pressure sodium is 24. So we're providing 95% of the light nutrition you need for good plant growth, for healthy plant growth. In addition, here's another equation that uh, we find helpful. Another benchmark is the color temperature of the sun, which is 5780 Kelvin. Now, plasma brings 5,500 Kelvin to the table, whereas legacy high-pressure sodium only brings 2,100 Kelvin to the table. So this is about full-spectrum light nutrition. It's what your plants need to thrive. They'll be healthier, you'll get more yield per watt, more chlorophyll content, and a better tasting product. We guarantee it. Thank you for stopping by, and we'll see you real soon.